Hi there and welcome back, dear friends and deep thinkers. To the empire of Portugal that has been cleansed a little bit. We still have many prisoners, but hey. Now it's time to distribute what is what is kind of left here. We have the county of Bijaja, for example, and uh, we also have the county of Algier. And uh, somehow we kind to uh, kind of need to need to give away a lot, just a lot, really, really, really a lot. So let's start by by seeing what we can give away here. Algier, we can grant it to someone, and we really would like to give it to our dynasty. And we'll sort them by opinion of us. And we'll see how it goes, right? Uh, so our player heir, but he already has everything that he needs. Um, his claims on tons of titles. Same is true for our brothers, so uh, we'll probably not give it to him. And that guy is Countess Leonor's Marshal. He's as to Leonese, he's young. He likes us a lot, because we are handsome. And he's, yeah, diligent, generous, call us. We kind of like this man. Um, Vela de Cantabria, he's of our house even. And we'll see, we have Algier, we have Tanas, and we could give him the duchy as well. So he'll love us like forever. So and that's for you, Vela de Cantabria. Oh, Basil, he already has a spouse, but no kids. That's his primary heir, the courtier of Duke Vela. Oh well, I believe he'll get he'll get some kid probably when his when his freaking strange spouse dies. He will take. Take another wife and then everything will be good. So so we've had Alja. Now let's let's see. We have we have quite a couple more things now. Um, as you can see we have our heir, for example, here. He already has eight titles. So we can give him the, the random thing out there. I don't think we have the duty of Palermo. Let's see. Duchy of Sicily. We don't have the Duchy of Sicily, right? So we want to maybe give him Palermo. Palermo is extremely good. We want just to grant this thing to our son. So let's grant him a title. It will be Palermo. Here we go. Because we'll care for the ones in the mainland and Palermo is just extremely good. It's so good. Um, it's something for our good air. So we've got Palermo, then we let's see about Tunis. Um, have we that stuff again here now? Yeah, I mean, we have Tripolitania. We need to give things like these away. That's our brother and vassal. Let's see. There's five out of five. Mm. His primary heir hates us because we have too many duchies. Okay, that's that's not that's not bad. Uh, now our half brother is a special case because he's kind of in our area, but he's also a vassal of Ghana. Hmm. And we have Infantasilu. He has all that he can muster. It's fine. Um, king Vladan of Takru. He's the king of Takru. What? The, when did that happen? He's already the king of, of Takro, that little one. Great stuff. Mm -hmm. So, um, now to see what we have, it's it's rather easy to, to do it like that way. Uh, so, what else? We, we want to get rid of the county of Tripolitana, right? Um, it's a good county. Don't get me wrong, but... Um, we want to give it away to to just someone. Uh, whom do we want to give it to? And we'll 
We want a loyalist there, right? Someone good. Count Ramon of Tuart. We don't also want someone who is not powerful. Mayor, mayor, mayor. We have this guy who is Kamal, his butcher. He would fit in, he likes us. Um, our food taster. We don't want to lose our food taster, but he's so good. Yeah, he, he likes us so much because we gave him money. Uh, mayor, mayor, mayor. Danielle de Coria. We can give her that thing? That's our. That's a son. Uh, he, he looks a little bit female somehow. Well, that's how you can err, right? That's how you can err. Probably beautiful, right? Yeah, beautiful. So, the more beautiful the people are, the more andro androgynous they, they seem somehow. They, the more universally appealing. Um, three claims. Duke of Tunis, County of Tunis, County of Medea. Hmm... This guy is ill. Don't want him there. This guy has a claim on the county of Waida. Yeah, he's the heir to that. We have Habil, who's Maghrebi. Mm. We have Ramiru, goddess Tays, generally based goddess Tays, our Seneschal. He likes us a lot. He's Astolianese. Sure. We'll give Tripolitana to you. You can get there. Uh, you're also married to our court jester. Here we go, man. Uh, okay, he will, he'll complain now. But it's fine. Ah, uh, he's no longer our seneschal, no longer our court jester, no longer our antiquary. They're taking so many away. Ah, uh, because sibling. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So. What more? What more needs to be given away? Give it away, give it away, give it away now. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, the Duchy of Sousse, probably. The County of Sousse. And the Duchy. Sousse, so, so far away. Where is Sousse? Is that here? Is that the. Yeah, that's the County of Sousse. Grant it to someone. Opinion, opinion, opinion. It's still only our dynasty. Remember. Gout ridden. Mm. We don't want to give it to an heir. Our bodyguard at night, Amelal de Castella. I'm sorry. Um would be a good choice but is but we, we want these people to get astolianese out there which is why we're looking for astolianese people sueruk suanes asnal kolar he's a good one is he still he's still feeling fine he's under constant care which means he's married too so he should have kids that's important Yeah, you'll become the Duke of Sous. She's got a couple of heirs. What about her? Why is she so... She's looking spindly. Frozen grief. She looks like a skull. Hmm. They seem to be good people. Okay. Our new vassal, and he likes us. Very nice. Very nice. Let's see. I have the duty of Bijaja. Ah, uh, the duty of Bijaja. Who can we grant it to? Our, our freaking food taster? Yeah, I mean... But we also need a food taster. I mean, he likes us, but we bribed him for it. So it's not... So let's make this a little bit clearer. We want Astolianesis. And we want 
Catholics. Maximum age of 45, that's fine. Male. Oh, we, we need to choose male anyways. Uh, adult, we don't care that much. Uh, claim. With no claims. So we can really go for people who are not heir to anything. Duke, Duke, uh, then we have this guy, Fernando, Gono Tres, Livigildiana, Madeira. Deceitful. Mm. But he seems good. He's Count Odonius Spymaster. Then we have this, this phenomenal guy here, <laughs> the robust man. Also deceitful. We don't like deceitful people in these positions. Um, Manuel Estebanes Livigildiana Ogo, he's handsome, he's intelligent, he's content. I like content people in these positions. <laughs> Should be good. He's, he's also married. Yeah. Bejaja and the county of Bejaja. We're down to twelve. It can only it can only be a while. Scroll down there to the county of Lagwat. It's here, it's just a random thing. Al Agwat. Also not a very good county. Um Astro Leonesis. Count of Donius Spymaster. Yeah, he's deceitful. We didn't want want him to get that because he's deceitful. Mm. Hmm. Christian, she's kind of constant care. He's arrogant, diligent, generous. Mm, I don't know. Rather someone shy, diligent and gluttonous. Also under constant care. Also Astor Leonese. Sure. Let's take him. You get the county of Lagwat. Best mustache. <laughs> Or it is two kids, that's good, so there'll be heirs. There will be heirs and a beautiful scaled wife. Now, more, more, more. Mm. Duchy of Aragon. What do we need to get rid of? Probably at least the Duchy of Aragon, right? We'll see about Portugal. Duchy of Toledo, Duchy of Seville, that's what we want to keep. And the Duchy of Portugale and the county out, out of that. Probably, uh, I don't know. County of Bragantha and Duchy of Portugal, something like that. Duchy of Aragon. Yeah, let's get let's get to the county. Alto Aragon. The county of Alto Aragon. Okay. Wow, root sellers. Mm-hmm. Pin Universe. Grandson of Count Axel. Our vassal knight. He hates us. Oh well. Ah, that's our grunt, grumpy veteran. But he's a mastermind philosopher and he's content. And a zealot. And already married. I think we're gonna give him that. And the Duchy of Aragon. A new generation of people. Wow, that's such a great county. 
One holdings above. Oh, one holdings above. Um. Let's see. Do we have too many duchies? Absolute crown. Too many. We have one too too, too many. But not too many kingdoms. We can give away. Um, so we have Porto, with Royal Forests, and Bragantha. Uh, we can give Bragantha away with. Um, Bragantha and uh, the Duchy of Porto. Let's see, what about this guy, who is Hale? Um, I don't know... In the Cantabria? Here is someone of our Cantabrians. That's probably pretty good. Beautiful genius. And he's married. He's got a diplomacy. Stewardship, Marshal, the grandson of Infante David. Okay, um, Infante David is probably one of our brothers or so. Hmm. Yeah. You'll get that thing. You'll become a Duke. Don't worry, be happy. Duke Guyen again. It's our generation. It's our generation. And a good generation it will be. Wow, wow, wow. We cleared it up. We cleared it up. And now we have tons of counties here. And maybe we might even get Quenza. We'll see about that. We'll see about that. If we get Quenza, we'll happily give away the rest of Portugal to I don't know whom yet. <laughs> Oh, what an act that was. Oh, I've clicked on, on, on Munio. He's still a count. We don't really want to leave him free out there. I mean, he's an excellent fortune builder and stuff, but hey. Uh, now we have to see what unfolds with our, with our prisoners. We can usurp titles. That's always really handy, like the Kingdom of Galicia. We'll do that as soon as we can. Let's see our council. Everything there's going pretty well so far. Yeah, it's all nice. Now let's hold our horses a bit. Get a favor hook to the impressive Velasco. Yeah, we're indeed impressive. I have arrived to pay homage to you. Ah, our new... Uh, I think he's... Yeah, that's our new Duke Vela. Show him in at once. Serve me well, Duke Vela. Serve me well. Divine Right? Hey, we've got Divine Right. Let's have a look at Divine Right. We just discovered Divine Right. And... Um, where do we have that? Was it here? It's probably here, right? Divine right. Can pass several of your claims in a single war. Unlocks the Palatinate feudal contract. Monthly piety increased by 10%. Short reign duration, minus 10%. And title creation cost, minus 20%. Known to us, uh, what more can we do? I think we would profit from increased man at arms. We would like that. We have... Uh, Knighthood is something we have already. Scutage. Hmm. No. Heraldry is something interesting. It doesn't give us much bonus, but... Yeah, I think we're going to go for Man at Arms. We're just fascinated by Man at Arms. We are Man at Arms people. We are Man at Arms people. We might capture the Kingdom of Asturias one day. Hmm. 
The Kingdom of Galicia. We can usurp that title, right? King Serardo wouldn't be amused. Also doesn't want to be a vassal. Duchy of Beja. Doesn't want to be a vassal. Um. Hmm. So building in Porto, we don't care, it will be enabled again. Usurping the Kingdom of Galicia. Yeah, we will only do that when we're battle ready again. If we are, like, have a war chest of 2000 or something. Uh, and then, because then it will be extremely good for us. And now we can host another exotic feast. Um, why is it so cheap for us now? Look at that. Here we go. Oh, and we, we probably have to... We have no antiquarian anymore. How did that happen? Uh, we have that guy here. Let's average it. We need a uh, a high almoner maybe, and we definitely need a seneschal. Roberto is good. He's <laughs> just such a random man, but he's young. Here we go. He'll take care of it. Can we have a court jester? I mean, we don't need one. Um, and here we have, we have a high almoner. We don't really need one. The others are pretty much needed, but... Bernaldo Mencius de Cantabria. He's very honest. <laughs> That's probably an advantage, right? Duke Yuva of Tunis. <laughs> no, we want someone good who, who likes his job then. I mean, we would like to have a court musician um how about ado cinda she'll probably move away we'll we'll take bernaldo here we go royal almoner court jester personal champion executioner not really there can i have a personal champion but we don't need one it's fine Can grant vassals to the rightful liege to King Rodrigo of Valencia. Oh, to our son. Interesting. Yeah, you'll get that. Uh, Rodrigo to Vladan of Infante Nunu of Tinduf. No, no, no. He's in prison. Duke Odonio, uh, no, we'll, we'll just wait a little bit. It's fine, it's fine. Child benefits from our spouse, nice. What about you? You look like you're sick. You have lover's box, an adulterer, you're inappetetic. You're feeling fine though. I don't, how did you manage to get our family so ugly? I mean, he's handsome still, but... A cheery gathering, the mood is bright, and the spirits are high as the feast begins. Very sweet, very sweet. Uh, the witness. As I stumble outside to relieve myself, I hear shouting around the corner. As I turn, I see my vassal Countess Maria sneer as she sinks the blade into the face of the covering Baron Raimundo. <gasps> Countess Maria. Baron Raimundo! What? Whatever sound uh, I made must have been enough, for Maria turns towards me. Surprise on, my fa on her face. My silence has a price. 
Everyone will know what have you done. Oh, woo. I don't know what she's a fearless black. She's wrathful. I mean, we've been in the same situation. We call us, we might, we might call her for the price. My silence has a price. Yeah, we call us like that. Making money from that. He's already dead. What does it hurt? He's already dead, right? Uh, won't let you let him go, Xin Inesis de Cantabria. Show sure, brother, you can have him. Mm. Todo Ordonez uh, revoked my title. Mm -hmm. Maria Gomez says she should leave as quickly as we can. Count Azur. Oof. She's still pending with revoke title. Arias Leonez. Uh, yeah, all of these are. The dilemma, the feast is dwindling down, and I find myself in conversation with my composed chancellor, Duke Sebastian. Nice. He inquires about my opinion on the blessings of marriage. Should subject is deeply interested in himself. Uh, yeah, sure, sure. It's a subject that fascinates me as well. Mm. Does he seek friendship or more? I don't know. He seems a little bit interested. As my guests depart, with everyone headed home, with bellies full of exotic delicacies, I'm proud to say the feast was a success. I have my wife Teresa to thank for much of its success. I feel nothing but gratitude as she sees the last guests off. Until next time. Until next time. We're an eager reveler. And we've been doing good. We've been doing real good. Let us see. Mm. Madrid. The county of Madrid. We need we need a holding here. Mm -hmm. Someone. Uh, something, I mean. Uh, usually a city is good, right? Let's build a city, another city in Madrid will surely be good. Rodrigo is in hiding. King Rodrigo, our son, complaining about Subadia bullying him. She's spindly, prowess six, rowdy and paranoid. He's a craven, what? Why not hide in your room instead? A uh, bully deserves whatever punishment you can imagine. He's arbitrary. Well, that's better than a craven, at least in our eyes. We can ask our head of faith for another bit of gold. 1,500 gold. That's perfect. I mean, we're content, so we're not going to go and conquest everything. But uh, we definitely want to secure what we're doing and we also would really like oh, look at that we could arrange a marriage maybe with no 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 ah caesar's triumph while studying the tactics of ancient generals i was amused to learn about Julius Caesar's exploits during his conquest of Gaul. During the siege of Alesia, Caesar determined that direct assault of the well-fortified city would be too costly. He instead ordered his army build his own fortress, which surrounded the entire city, trapping the enemy garrison inside to starve while simultaneously preventing reinforcements from relieving the defenders. Wow. Caesar took a risk with the plan, but that paid off. No, it's too diligent. We, we could... Make the enemy come to you. I like it. Yeah, yeah. The unyielding defender. We would like that. 
That's a diligent approach, really diligent approach to war. Um, and we should we should look into really usurping again. Of course, we can usurp Galicia. I mean, we like this man, but he doesn't want to be our vassal. Mm. Let's see if he's even he's he's even Cantabria. Oh, that's so hard. How about better Joss? Cannot declare war because that would break the truce. He's also for our dynasty. What else? What else is going on there? Yeah, we have we have ample other options. Right, I mean there was Galicia. We, we were looking at that. Maybe there's another option that we could we could gain something. Count Arnul of Guard. He will not accept. We could declare war. We have no Casus Belli at all. All right, then. How about the Kingdom of Ghana? We have uh, Infante David's claims. That would make sense. Duke Estebanus claims. That would make sense. Countess Marina's claims. The Duchy of Mema. He has the County of Gadamis. County of Bassa. Hmm. I mean, certainly indebted to that man. He's he's helped us so much. He's been the best general. So let's see. There's the county of Barca. Here's the Duchy of Casa. I mean, he has he has so much already. So it's kind of pointless. Duke Estebanu. What about him? The Duke of Navarra, he has only two titles. Kanya Agudjimaka, Rut, And Countess Marina, what about her? She only has the county of Satish. We can give her the Duchy of Mima. That's the biggest thing, right? Okay, Countess. Here we go! After all, it's war again. We've had our feast. Start into Gunt! Raise the men at arms! It's time we test ourselves. Enduring hardships, strict organization, Bellum Justum. Yeah, we would like Bellum Justum for the future. And uh, then we'll return to our path. Ghana! It's our army! This man, but we'll lead that ourselves. Uh, we shall siege. We shall, shall siege Mercy. And we have you here. We need someone who can siege well. Rodrigo. Mm, he'll go to Diara. He has more siege machines than we have? Yeah. But we're better in general. Here we go. Awful Vassal accepts something. We have low county control in Ucles. Uh Is there something we can do about that? Not really. Team. Someone is plotting to kill my wife, Empress Teresa. We must stop the villain behind this. This is so crazy. We we'll learn the language of Prince Malay. Yeah, we want to do that. And then we want to romance our wife. But that has time. We, we can only romance our wife now. We are Otherwise, we're too old to, for for the reason to romance somehow. We, we really want to be... We want to have a soulmate. 
We will soulmate with her so often. Uh, secretly plant a letter in her chambers. We'll impress her by winning a sparring match. I dedicate this victory uh, to you, my love. Bringing you honor is my only desire. Soldier fought valiantly, but I disarm him with the final floor, the thrust. My song girl is speechless, but clearly flattered. Why else would she be smiling thusly? Theresa won't resist my charms for too long. They're waiting here for us, kind of. The Countess, yeah, the Duchy of Mima, of course. They're guarding this. They're guarding this. Mm. Let's see what they do. They are losing supplies every day. We do that too, but it's not that. What? What do you want, King of Badajoz? Uh, the Livigildiana Chronicles. Uh, sure, you can have it. So many artifacts. Count Lopez escaped the dungeons. Uh -huh. Okay, so you're back in, back in town. You left the prison. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Arias de Cantabria is a witch. Hmm. What's going on here? We don't know. We don't know. We don't care. You swear to count Munyu? He doesn't have much income anymore. He's ailing. We'll release him. Count Azur. Still want to revoke his title. He has a feudal contract with protected title revocation. Oh my goodness me. Modifying the contract. We must get a hook on him. We must get a hook on him. Want to get a hook on him? And we can banish him? No. We want to get a hook on him. He's protected from that, that bastard. Farewell, Azur. But now... We'll use a hook. Uh, that's... That's not gonna be good. Um, here we go. Default title revocation. And now we can revoke his title. <laughs> We, ah, that's that's a nice thing. If he declines, he'll rise, but he will not decline. And we'll get Quenta. Sure, here we go. You can go without your county. Without your county. <laughs> Quentha, nice, nice. We we finally got Quentha now. Uh -huh. That's that's so nice. That's so nice. I think now we have the full duty of Toledo. Again, I I think. Is there some something missing? Maybe Molina. Yeah, Molina is missing. We have Count Garcia on that. Now we have much of it now. We have much of it. Mm. We should look around if we can give... Yeah, we'll wait and we'll give our our son... Once he's uh, of age, we'll give him another county of ours. Mm -hmm. uh, what? Uh, you to the winsome Emperor Velasco. What? Bleak affection? No. 
What? A 74-year-old lunatic wants to romance us. Great stuff. Uh, we control Kanyaga. That's nice. Uh, let's continue to the to the capital. And we need new siege machines as soon as we can. But hey, we'll take it now, for now. What are they doing? Neutral army of the Gaza. What are you doing? Why are you running in there? Dying. What the hell? What was that even? During the siege of Tagasa? Ah, okay. Yeah, I mean, we are related to them, I guess. Galicia has problems. What problems? Defending against, defending against our dukes. In artifact claim wars and other things. Interesting. Tum pa dum pa dum pa dum pa dum pa dum pa dum. Can we, we can ransom Velasco Sikwid. Why are you revoked my title? Uh, and who will relieve him? Captain Alfonso of the Portuguese band of Bragantha. Um, no. You know what? He can renounce his claims. Yeah, here you go. Mm hmm. We captured the sun and air. Nice. We should be in on that soon. Once, once we have that, they're not just not doing anything. I mean, it's the reasonable thing to do. No one will die. On the other hand. Just sitting there, losing their supplies. Hmm. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> we need to reform our army that now with... Ah, graceful age. We're aging? Ah, we're 30 now, so we gained some learning. Nice. That makes a lot of sense. Hmm. We'll get more from here, yes. Okay, we've got Masin. Hello and goodbye. Countess Marina is now Duchess Marina of Mima. So be it. And she why does why doesn't she like us? I was now she decides the county of Kugar. Alright, I understand. But that's not mine. That's not mine. That's not mine. She's already infirm. Oh well. Oh well. We took a little bit of Ghana and added it. I mean, we're pretty, pretty okay. There's the kingdom of Borgu. What about Galicia and Badajoz? Can, do we have any reasons to declare war? Ah, it's still a truce. It's still a truce. How about the Duchy of Beja? Ah, hello there. You know what? Do you want to be a vassal? No, we're not his rightful liege. Who is your ally? King Fernando of Badajoz. Hey, hey, hey. Baron Savaricus claims. Uh, and Bermudo Livigildiana Setubal's claims. He's unlanded. What does he have? Beja. Alcázar de Sol. He was forcibly recruited. Yeah, I mean, you could be... He's our knight. Sure, we want the Duchy of Beja. Hmm... 
needs some point of attack here at the coast. Raise the men-at-arms. And we're hunting our wife. Ah, when Empress Teresa suggested a hunt, I did not hesitate to organize one. I do anything for a mere glimpse of my treasure. I mean, she cannot run so quickly, right? She's obese. I'm stalking through the underbrush, my page at my heel and my hound just ahead. It seems as if it has found a trail. And suddenly my concentration is shattered by a woman's scream. I'm coming for you, my love. Within what must have been a minute, but felt like an hour, I reach a clearing. Teresa is on the ground before me, disheveled and weaponless opposite her. Just about to strike stands a huge wolf. My arrow strikes true and the beast falls to the ground. For a moment, all Teresa can do is stare. Then she stumbles towards me and throws herself into my arms. I need you, my love. Right here and now. It's also very prestigious because that's just knightly behavior. Um, okay, we'll go over here. Take that. We, we don't need our... Um, you've Count Lope? <laughs> Count Lope, nah. We we'll go ourselves this time. We're too, we're too interested in war not to do this. Yeah, nice. So we're in a good, good field. Finished the increase control in Medellin. Now, where we, can we send you? Go to Ucles. Charge! What an advantage. What a fight. Now let's take it on. Captured someone. Oh well. That should legitimately belong to me, says King Ramiro's Chancellor Count Odonio. Nope. Aha. You just Ximena is now a ruler. Very nice. Our vassal. A new vassal. Oh, she's a ruler? Really? Okay. How the frick did that happen? Oh well. Oh well. We'll see how that goes. Escaped in front of Noon who has escaped. Uh. Curse you, Nuno. We need to look into our prison. We have too many prisoners. We should relieve them all um, of their claims. Except this man, maybe. He's feeling fine. Oh my god. I mean, he's obese. That's probably an advantage here. You can go. Leave the prison. Yeah, that's the way more effective thing, right? Relieving them of their claims instead of letting them in jail. We've captured someone. Great stuff. And now... Here we go. You're our vassal now. We're being raided. Are 
bit of Timbi Timbi. Can't just show sure nothing. There's probably not much there. Counter seems to be really weak. Wow, Galicia is so in trouble. What's going on there? Count or Don, you count whatever. You're the liege sitting in Tagaza and Malta. That's. I don't know. Armies are raised. Yeah, I know. I know. Um, we can't march down there. That's that would be idiotic. Mm. I will just disband the army. Uh, we need to get rid of the onagers, finally. And we need to create a Mangonels regiment. Can we, can we get something going down there? I mean, really? Raise the local army, oh God. Not you. Not you. Not you. Not you. Oh, we cannot disband. Schema discovered. Uh, Mayor Fatumata is plotting against my wife. Murder her? No. Friendless fiend. Hello there! Oh, we've got a couple of problems for you. Oh, do we have someone quick? Else we go ourselves, I don't know. Charge! Boom. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. We have a new perk. Good, 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 good. On for courtship. Um, now we're a little bit stressed. We should probably go for a hunt. Right, that, that would be something healthy. Sound the horn, go for a hunt. Time for a new hobby. Rumors. The noise from the others have has faded away by the time friend Duke Sebastian and I stalk up on the wolf. We're almost within striking distance when Sebastian whispers to me now that we're finally by ourselves. There is something uh, you I have to let you know about Count Martin. 
No, no, I'm getting that wolf man. Uh, can't go in drank himself to death. Uh, oh my. Well, he's had a quid. He's had a kid. No, I was a spy master. What did you do? Duke Munio. A vassal, and he's really in in uh, in love with us, right? So to say, Count Martin, the foreigner. This guy is fantastic. This guy is fantastic. Hmm. Can still usurp got uh, the. Kingdom of Galicia, but they are, aren't they at war? Yeah. So we can actually not do it. How about Badajoz? Count Lopez Clay. <laughs> really? The county of Badajoz for Count Lopez? Ah. Hmm. Infante Rodrigo of Saab, our brother? <laughs> really? Uh, he'll not attack us, I guess. Um. But we're, we're cool and calculating. We would really like to get that county, right? Raise the men at arms! We're returning from the wild! Hunt is drawing to an end. We mount our horses to leave the farmlands behind as the servants prepare the wolf and the game for the journey back. In spite of our difficulties along the way, the hunt went very well and we return home reinvigorated. And uh, we'll go ourselves. We need some experience here. Charge! A claim on Cuenza? Aha! Count Gomez has a claim on Owen Cuenza. Lies and more lies. My daughter! Teresa, you've been so brave. We have a beautiful, beautiful daughter. Very sweet. Very sweet. Maybe we want to learn the daughter this time. That's possible. Who shall educate her? That's something for our wife. Um, but our wife is not good at being learned. You know, then maybe, maybe you go for diplomacy again, little one. May you grow to be strong and wise, my daughter. What is that? Where are you going? Stay here. I'll get you. The time is now. Is that your advantageous terrain? Ha! We'll get to Badajoz and take that away from you. Discovered scootage! Oh my god, a secret exposed. My brother has an extra martial affair uh, with his lover Fronilde. His crime a secret exposed. Hermann Xilde was fathered by him. Our poor nephew. Who would have known? Well. Brother, it's not you that is imprisoned. Solitude in the Great Hall. Ah, he's had a difficult time in the in the feast. Slipped underneath one of the tables. They're hid people from the entire meal. The important now, uh, if it was a show, you could simply have left. Yeah. 
Rather be impatient, son. Fonte David, finish the increased control in the county task of Ucles. Ah, nice. Yeah, where will we send you now? Uh, we need control in Quintha. Because we have also have Quintha now. Aha. Count Molendu converted from Astolinese to Soninka Astolinese. Uh, what are they doing? Will they attack or will they not? They will attack. Okay, Duchess, Duchess Ximena wants our daughter Teresa there. Mm, of course she'll be there. Infante David died of old age? No, uncle. Who is now the duke instead of you? This guy, he, he looks like the spitting image of our father. Duke Lope Fronildis of Casa. Good man, probably. And whom have we here? We need a new marshal, our brother, master of the hunt and vassal, Infantasilo Rodriguez. Sure. You will do that, you will do that. Band of brothers. Hmm. We need a new master of the, of the horse or something like that, right? King Ramiro of Asturias. Sure. He's loyal. He's excellent. We'll take him. I'll have better knights. Son learned the Berber language. Very useful. And we have one. Hey there. Captured the king. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Count Lopi. Count Lopi. We can have... Uh -huh. We have this guy now. So he kind of likes that, but now we can uh, modify the feudal contract. Or we can revoke the title with a hook. <laughs> Will you use a hook? No, that's an act of tyranny. Not modifying that though is uh, we'll modify your feudal contract. You know, is that good? Use a hook. That's an act of tyranny, but that one is not. So he'll pay me some tax. Why can't we? Obligations have already been changed. Why? Aha. Uh -huh. You can only change the aha. Uh -huh. Well, that's bad. What what are we going to do with that hook then? Demand an artifact. We have the spare of destiny. Wow, that's an illustrious item here. We'll use a hook. And he hates us for that. <laughs> he would just give it to us like that. Oh, he has so many great things. The Spare of Destiny is really good though. Nah, we don't need it. That's the thing. We don't need it. Hello, Duke Bermundo. Bermudo of Beja. How do you do? You desire some counties. Okay, serve me well, serve me well. Uh, 
so we're building something in Madrid. Uh, that's nice. Toledo, La Jara, yeah. We have Ucleth, everything is, oh, not, not totally everything. Cuenza. And Molina is not in our hands yet, as of yet. As of yet, Ucleth, is there something empty here? Construct a new city. Got Quintha. Also construct a new city here. Can ransom Fronilde. Oh, what about Fronilde? She's got nothing. Our brother wants her uh, his lover back. And you, Alvaro, my courtier Alvaro, approaches me with concerns regarding the state of our educational materials. Uh, okay, uh, take these funds, make great, great education. Why not? Once we have a little bit more money, we'll also hold court again. Kingdom of Galicia and the Kingdom of Badaid Jos can now be usurped. That's really, really tempting. We'll do it. Usurp. Now, my good man, do you want to? <laughs> we have good reason to declare war on you. No. Um, now we have this kingdom title. Let's see if that's uh, if that's something we should not have. Too many kingdoms? No, there's just too many duchies. Not too many kingdoms. Mm -hmm. The Astolianese brooch. <sighs> the Duchess of Mima. No, you'll die soon. I know it. Uh, no, probably not, but... About Galicia, not yet. We'll not yet steal that. Ah, uh, someone is plotting to kill me. We must stop that. What the hell? A claim on Quintha? Duke Orgonio. Lies and more lies. Wow. We should have given them that. that. He's so excellent, that intrigue. What? We have seven new court artifacts? What happened? Did someone die? I, I guess so. King of Vico's table. Maria's cabinet. It's... The table is a little bit better. King of Vico's table. Is there anything else? The Vasconia statue. That is pretty great. Yeah, but these things give renown, right? So we need to go for Maria's cabinet. Pretty, pretty beautiful. It's just good to have these here. Illustrious and fame. What about the jewelry casket? Do we have something better? Not really that much. What about Infantis Warhammer? <laughs> Gyalpo Chandra Muk Havarman, Havarman's Mace. Oh well. The Elixir of Youth. Maybe we'll display that. <laughs> For everyone to sip a drink. 
Still need some more kids. Oh. Duke Lope, of course. No. The Astro Leonese Brooch is kind of cursed, but they would like something else instead. It's basically the thing that we would never give them is the Astro Leonese Brooch. One of the only things. King Fernando. It's my rival Gundamaru that is trying to kill me. Uh -huh. Where is he even? At King Xuan's court in Marrakesh. He's feeling fine, the squeamish fiend. Can I imprison him? This is an act of tyranny. But he's trying to kill us. Can challenge him to fight. You know what? We might like that. Um, he has Ildegard's Spare, which is something. Here we go. Gundamaru, for a brief moment. Gundamaru and I pace in lazy half circles, each watching for an opening. I brandish my king dagger of uh, Adolfonso's dagger of valor, ready de to defend myself. While he clutches his Ildegard spare, film firmly to hand this fight my own. We be the f till first blood, but that does needs my nerves. Yeah, um, you think you can beat someone as famous as me? He would gain stress. I think he's already stressed, is he? No increase to success. Mm. Low increase to success. That's the best you've got. You can't even hit me. Time and time again, I backpedal, dodge, and weave, always keeping just within tempting target distance. Soon, Kunamara is showing signs of exhaustion. He tries to feint left with his spear, only to strike for my heart. A concealed dagger in his offhand. My form is excellent, with little chance for mistake, and his stance is formidable. I've yet to open up my opponent's guard and all, and seen a way yet to claim victory. Ah, uh, his knife to hand. Oh, he has tricks. I'll show you how I brandish a dagger. Uh, better man than you have tried trying to break my guard. Defeat? What? Few would argue that my guard is anything less than nigh impossible to break, yet somehow my opponent manages it, possibly by skill, possibly by luck. All that matters is that after a few spear blows, his weapon is resting coldly against my throat, the sharp point pushing against my jugular. <gasps> Rue the day you defeated Emperor Velasco. I lose stress? No, I, I, I gain stress. We lost against him. We lost, but we wanted to do that. Successful wound treatment. Bless you, dear court physician, bless you. I know you're insane, but <laughs> you're also insanely good. Uh, maybe uh, we'll give you a wife, right? How about... <laughs> How about... The wonderful... Um, Varela Tesacan de Wes de Lerena. No? How about Aurengard Carling to mix someone in? <laughs> Here we go. A curse undone. And he's died. Ah, not one day too soon. 
The sensible Velasco, I accept your marriage proposal. May God grant us long life and many children. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's exactly the intention. So we fought him and he finally died. My goodness. We'll thank God for that. Indeed, we will go on a pilgrimage. We cannot afford it yet. Hmm. Okay, then we'll not go on a pilgrimage yet. Have to wait for a bit. What have we learned? Promising prospects, marriage acceptance for close extended family and for ourselves. Yeah, that's nice. We'll do that. But alas, there's no more murder on us. Mm. And ask for gold? Yeah, we want to do that. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Don't you like us anymore? No. What did we do? Oh, we requested gold. Huh. Okay, all right. There's something we can sponsor. The metalsmith. Uh, we don't need artifacts. We have so many artifacts. Really. Um, Quenta is now under control. Good, good, good. Uh, increase control in... I don't know, Olmedo. Or wherever. Mm. Our son's county is under control. Valencia, Tlemcen. How did he get to Valencia? Oh, we, we gave it to him probably, right? The King of Valencia. Um, increasing control. Uh, sure, let's go Olmedo. Can also Galicia now. First, we want to go on a pilgrimage. Prepare for the journey. And we'll just go visit the Pope. Maybe he'll give us some money. It's the first time that we visit him. It's time to depart. My realm must wait. We're going there. We're cold-blooded, so we're really going there to get some money. A rude story. Passing by the campfire, one of my fellow travelers is telling a story she once heard about some emperor to raucous laughter. They all fall silent when I approach, except for the storyteller. Ah, don't worry, my lord, you're nothing like the coxcomb in this story. It's about the emperor of some faraway place like called Portugal. Really? Tell me more about this emperor. Apparently we are humorous. <laughs> From Baranis to Bozo, oh well. All roads lead to Rome. Pilgrims flock to Rome from all over the Christian world. And standing here with the other pilgrims, I sense a feeling of solemn unity and fellowship shared amongst the gathered, all having overcome various trials and tribulations along their journey. I walked the holy path. Really dedicated. And we we'll return soon. It's good to be home. Everyone is looking at us differently. Also the Pope, because we're a pilgrim. Well then. Can imprison more criminals? What about her? She, she kind of likes us, but we hate her. What about our cupbearer? Uh, of course, we need our cupbearer. We need our cupbearer. Kid, you're good. What, what about you? With suspicion, I took Rodrigo out playing with a bow to 
my surprise, he ran into a wounded doe. He later lashed out at me, thinking I had staged the old look encounter as a kind of test. Oh, then show me that you could have felt an animal yourself. Become ambitious. A degraded artifact, the Soninkus bear. An offer. Mm. Soninkus bear. I knew there was a catch, but fire. he gets a weak hook on us. Nope. It's low durability. Oh, well. I'll give it to someone someday. Hello! You know me, I was the pilgrim who was recently there. I'm sure you have noticed. Duke Manuel wants the Astolianese brooch. What else? What else would he want? Nope. It's the battle for the Astor. I should really destroy that artifact. It's too dangerous in the hands of them. Are we currently building? Yeah, we're currently building. Have we had... Nah, there's a city. With anything here? Nope. We're building around... Mm. We need to do something against our stress, really. It's... Too stressful out there. We need a court jester. I know we need a court jester. A court jester. How about Infante Nunu? It's ideal. He hates us anyway. And a court poet? No. Mm, personal champion, nah. Royal architect, high almoner. Yeah. Oh, we could be on the good side of our patriarch. These people all have jobs already, nah. Champion, maybe? They are not as good as we are, though. Which is kind of a problem, right? How are our prisoners, uh, Agnes? Agnes? She's temperate, brave, content, scarred. I think we should recruit her. Clara Leonores? Our prisoner. No one will take her at a court. Oh well. How about Boson? Demanded a hook. Uh, you can ransom him. Admiral Sedukid. He's an intrigue courtier. Hmm. I mean, he, he could be... He could be useful. He seems good-natured. We can employ him as an executioner. <laughs> sure, 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 sure. Here you go. You're the executioner now. That's totally us. Rodrigo? I don't know. We can recruit him. La Ladina? 
kind of likes us. Uh, she's pretty. What kind of claim does she have? The County of Viseo. We don't care about that. Let's, re let's just recruit her. We have Muno. Stubborn, wrathful, greedy. Maybe it can help with something, I don't know. Never know. Let's have him. Yeah, you all come here. It's gonna be pretty good at the court. Already had a court. Oh, my poor son, what? Ill with consumption, the future is uncertain. This is an enemy I cannot protect him from. Oh. It's ill with consumption, he's still feeling fine. Wow. Duke Lope. Why, why, why are all our enemies always called Lope? Lope Fronildes of Casa. Uh, he's created the Liberty Faction against us. How strong is the freaking Liberty Faction? It's him now. He's got a kid. No, uh, we need a little son so we can marry away the faction. Desert Warrior. He's known for his prowess in military matters. Uh, will you teach me a so? You count so Pontius of Draina. The melancholic, gout ridden, obese, disfigured man. Impressive, my lord. My inclination towards the teachings of Count Zo might not come as a surprise. I find myself satisfied nonetheless. Finally, I know what that fuss was about. We're now a desert warrior as well. Wow, and how good we are. Really, really nice. We have some villages constructed too. We can host another feast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good thing. Let's host a feast. We have got the money, a cheery gathering. Welcome, friends. Welcome, friends. Disaster strikes. Oh, time to crack open my secret stores. We always have extra wine, even if the wine goes goes out. Mutual spirits. Thanks to the presence of Empress Theresa. It became an extraordinary, exceptional feast. What a good evening that was. Oh, no. Uh, someone is plotting to kill my coach, Sueru. Oh no, you must stop the villain behind this. And also our court tutor died. Did he die at the feast or what? That's terrible. We have uh, our court physician who is excellent at the job, but he's already our court physician. We don't want him to be stressed. We have our guard calling. She's good at that. I have Rodrigo, our courtier. Also good at that, but he's deceitful. Oh, uh, we don't want deceitful people at that. We don't want that, no. Everybody's deceitful or sadistic at our court. What the hell? Look at our insane court physician. He's not these things. Not at all. What about Munio? Well, aptitude average. Okay, let's appoint him. He's not the best, but hey, maybe we'll find a learned man one day could do that for us. Let's 
going on with the feast. Uh, ah, Osterhild has given birth to a son. Osterhild of Sequid. Are they at our court? No. Imel. Imel the Cantabria. May you grow strong and wise, little Imel. As every one of our men, you need to become a good knight. Our courtier here will teach you. Uh, wait. Remove the guardian. Now educate the knight. Educate the child again. You convert his culture. Here we go. May you grow strong and wise, Imel. All gonna be good. As my guests depart, with everyone headed home with bellies full of exotic delicacies, I'm proud to say, feast was a success. I have my wife, Teresa, to thank for much of its success, and I feel nothing but gratitude as she sees the last few guests. It ends, and hopefully our son has eaten merrily. He's feeling fine. Oh, consumption. Reduce the disease symptoms. Mm. At least that. At least that. So there's hope for our son. We just had a great feast. We're looking forward to maybe attacking Badajoz to dismantling Galicia. These are the ne next steps when we want to gain control of Hispania again, and then we'll look to Africa. But step by step, we're content after all. Have a great time until next time, and happy gaming. This is Imanul Khan signing out. See you soon, and happy gaming.